Okay, looking at it, 09 Midnight Warrior. Most of you guys already know that. A couple modifications. Stiletto seat. And the simple things that everybody does that owns a Warrior. Mods the back license plate area a little bit. Kind of a homemade hack job for now. A Vance and Hines Pro Pipe without the Vance and Hines Pipe baffle. I removed that and I put in a big city thunder baffle which is in the collector area right before the megaphone. So that's what that is. Yamaha speed scoop on the side and the Boulevard windshield which if you're wearing a full face helmet that's great other than that you got some serious buffing uh, buffeting going on on your on your uh, on your face so it does take the wind off your chest um, still undecided whether or not I like that just start it up so you guys know the difference between the big city baffle and the standard Vance and Hines baffle <laughs> Complete cold start. So hasn't been running yet. Bike's got 4,000 miles on it now. Very pleased overall. Like to change out the bars, get something a little more ergonomically correct for my frame. I'm just about 5'9, 29 inch inseam, 32, 33 inch arm length so I'm reaching a little bit it's a lot of fun on short rides but you go to distance and uh, you get some some aches and pains up top so I gotta I gotta change that up That also has the Power Commander 5 set up on there and the Church Key V-Pack set up with the Velocity Stacks and K&N intake uh, filters underneath the tank. Thanks for looking.